As the race for L.A. County District Attorney heats up as George Gascon gets another challenger. Superior Court Judge Craig Mitchell has served L.A. County for more than 45 years, first as a high school teacher, then a prosecutor, and for 18 years as a judge. He may be best known for founding the Skid Row Running Club, and I'm honored to have the Honorable Judge Craig Mitchell join me now in studio. Thank you so much for being with me on this Labor Day. Absolutely, thank you. All right, why don't you, uh, you have the mic on for your voters who are watching tonight. Introduce yourself for those who aren't familiar with you. Well, uh, as you have indicated, I've been serving Los Angeles for 45 years, uh, three wonderful careers, 17 years teaching high school in South Los Angeles primarily, 11 years as a prosecutor, and 18 years on the bench handling felony trials. And I had no idea three years ago that I would be entering this race. But what I have seen in my courtroom for the last three years has prompted me to change my plans and address what I consider to be some real problems in our criminal justice system. What have you seen in your courtroom? About three weeks after Gascon came into office, a gentleman came into my courtroom and he said, Judge Mitchell, I was stabbed 13 times. I almost bled out on the pavement. Why was this man who did this to me charged with assault and not attempted murder? He almost killed me. Why wasn't he given extra time for inflicting great bodily injury? And I had to look at the man and said, I absolutely agree with you, but judges do not decide what is being charged. That is the role of the prosecutor. Let me just take you up to the present time. About two months ago in my courtroom, there was a trafficker of methamphetamine, 20 kilos of methamphetamine. What was the prosecution's offer? Time served, three days in jail, mm. probation. So that trafficker is out on probation right now? Absolutely. Free man. Free man. Absolutely, with almost no consequence. So if you are DA, what does that look like? How do you differ from the your opponents who are in the race, four of which are in the DA's office right now, who we have introduced to our audience? What would separate you? What separates me is the fact uh, that my experience is going to inform my decisions. Um, you know, in a courtroom for the last 18 years, right next to me is the witness stand. I have listened to sexual assault victims explain what happened to them. I have listened to child abuse victims, tears running down their face explaining the travesties that were perpetrated against them. I've sat in a courtroom, looked out in the audience, and seen the family members of murder victims. Currently, the policies of George Gascon disproportionately favor those who commit crimes and largely ignore the right of victims of crime to receive justice as well. And that balance needs to be restored. And my vantage point from the bench, and turning back to when I was a teacher, mm. you know, I taught young people who overcame tremendous challenges in their lives. And so I know that if people receive the support they need, the encouragement, live in safe communities, are able to focus on what matters, their lives can play out in incredibly positive ways. Which brings us to your Skid Row Running Club, and we have less than a minute, okay. uh, uh, which I'm <laughs> sorry about. But uh, Skid Row Running Club, it, that really has shaped your criminal justice outlook. How so? My working with the Skid Row Running Club has given me a real education on two of the major impediments to solving the homeless crisis in Los Angeles, addiction and mental illness. And I believe beyond any other candidate in the race, I understand those phenomena. I understand what the criminal justice system can do to take people from addiction to long-term sobriety. That is what the Skid Row Running Club has educated me on. And you go out there three times a week. You have a running date tomorrow at 5.30 a.m. 
as I have for the last 12 years, 52 weeks out of the year. Amazing. Well, you know I'm a big runner, so I support <laughs> your, your running club uh, tremendously. Uh, thank you again for all the work that you've done in your 45-plus years in L.A. County, and best of luck to you in your candidacy.